advantage. Sam Kerr on spot. Here is Hales looking to thread it into the penalty area. It was towards Ale. Jill Scott couldn't quite get it under control. Gregory takes it with the outside of her foot. And a bright start by Aston Villa. Here is Claire Emsley, though. Thinks about a shot, and it balloons over the bar. It was given away, but instead it comes to Emsley in the end after a slight missed interception by Jody Hutton. Christensen's little clip towards the back post. It's headed in, and Everton are in front. And Lucy Graham scores. And the team that never lose to those beneath them are in front with their first real ending of the game. Lucy Graham scores for Everton. Rasso. Goes the cross, handball, penalty. Well, Everton will get the opportunity to double their lead. It's Lucy Graham. It's saved by Vice. She goes the right way and hands Aston Villa a vital lifeline here. That's Arthur's ball. It might come towards Freya Gregory. The opportunity opened itself up. McKeever makes a fine save. It is Pattinson's cross. It is a deep one towards Finnegan at the back post. It's a second penalty. Well, Savika went down under the challenge from Jody Hutton. It's Izzy Christensen who makes it 2-0 to Everton. She provided the first, she scores the second, and Everton moves clearer out of sight, and Aston Villa's relegation worries just increase that little bit more. Everton 2, Aston Villa 0. Scott gets it back. A couple of blue shirts ahead of her. Scott goes to McGill. McGill to touch away from her, Sante, and a fine save again by Lisa Weiss. Mo Vault. Graham's ball into Emsley. Emsley with a bit of space. It comes towards Jill Scott. It's a fine block by Anita Asante, but it's poked in by Simone McGill. And Everton do have their third. Simone McGill denied moments ago by Lisa Weiss, but not to be kept out on the second occasion. Everton three, Aston Villa nil. In it goes by Arthur, up go the heads at the back post, it's Ali, it's towards Larson who misses her kick, it's punched away by McKeever, might come to Ali, Savika gets it clear, and Villa's opportunity for a late consolation goes awry. Silva and Larson and Arthur are the targets, it's towards Arthur, whose header is looping and whose header is in, and Aston Villa do have a late consolation through Chloe Arthur, they have tried until the very last and Aston Villa do have a goal back, a looping header by Chloe Arthur. It is Everton.